Hey, Julia, what's up? Did your YouTube get chopped off? No. Hey guys, it's Julia, and I'm coming at you today from my car because today we're on a journey to test out inexpensive haircuts versus expensive haircuts. So I'm going to be getting a haircut for $50, and then I'm going to be getting a haircut for $400 and seeing the differences, which one's better. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe for more of my videos. Let's see if we can get this video to 40,000 likes for me risking my hair and getting it cut twice in one day. Ah! If you didn't already know, I'm holding a 2 million subscriber giveaway. So I'm going to be giving away this prize right here to the YouTube winner. And all you got to do is just subscribe to my channel for that. And I'm going to be giving away this iPad Air 2 to the Instagram winner. And all you got to do is just be subscribed to my channel. Follow me on Instagram. Then click the link in my description to the picture that I need you to tag three friends to be entered in the Instagram prize. So the winners will be announced on this day right here. Now let's go ahead and get my haircut. So what do you think they could do for a $50 haircut? I'm not really sure. I think maybe just like a trim, just like cutting off the dead ends and stuff. No, it sucks. Do you think since it's so cheap they might mess it up? I mean, it's not that cheap. I feel like they're gonna do a pretty good job, but I don't think they're gonna do anything extravagant. Like, they probably won't be able to wash it and style it, but I think it'll look pretty good. Hi! Hi! Hey, Julia. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So I'm gonna get a trip. Okay, so we're here at Brass and Pocket in downtown LA, and I'm here with Corinne, and I'm going to be getting an affordable haircut. Tell me a little bit about what you uh, are looking for today. Okay, well, I'm definitely looking to just get rid of all the dead ends. I okay. straightened my hair too much. Okay, let's get started. Cool. So, we're going to do a drying mix today because you have curly hair. Um, so, we'll put some product on it afterward, kind of reform the curls, you know, the frizzy hair. What? What's up with your hair? You like it? What is this? Kidding! What do you think? Cool? It's cool. So, since this haircut is so expensive, what do you think you're gonna get? I think I wanna do something like extra, something I've never done before. Like, I've had my hair like pretty much long forever, and I kinda wanna go short, I think. Cool. Do you think you're gonna dye it? Yeah, I'll probably get like more highlights or see what they say. I kinda wanna get their input, you know? That's smart. That's definitely smart. Alright, so yeah, let's go. Let's, right, let's do go. this. Let's do it! Okay, so we're here at Ultra Lux Salon in Redondo Beach, California. So, I'm gonna see what they can do for my hair with $400. She'll be right with you, just take a seat, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay, so we're about to start the dyeing process. Gonna put in some highlights. So, being inspired by London Fashion Week, we're gonna do more of a textured bob, a little longer in the front, keeping layers a little choppy to bring out some of the colors we're gonna paint through your hair. Trisha's gonna shadow room her and put on her glasses. I think my favorite part about getting my hair cut is getting my hair washed and they massage your head. So I have to sit here for 10 minutes while this gloss makes my hair all shiny and stuff. We don't just stick to one single type of style or, you know, genre. We do everything that you can imagine. Our mindset is just really 
here's our canvas, you know? We are blessed to get out of the bubble and be able to work everywhere from New York to London to Paris, and we've been achieving all those goals, and uh, we continue to do that, but still come right back to home, you know? Julia, that took forever. Really? Well, do you notice anything different? Yeah, it looks nice. It looks good. They cut it a little short, but it looks good. You, you can't tell that. They cut it really short. Mm -hmm. Kinda, yeah. <laughs> next day and I'm still in love with my haircut. So this experiment went really well. Both haircuts actually turned out great and I was definitely happy with both. Now realistically, I'm sure most people can't afford to go to a top hairstylist for a $400 haircut, so you can still always get a very nice haircut for inexpensive. Glad that I was able to share this experience with you. If you enjoyed this video and this experiment, make sure you subscribe to my channel. And if you want to see more of these like inexpensive versus expensive beauty style haircut whatever type videos, let me know in the comments down below and let me know what kind like clearly BuzzFeed has got the food down but no one's really doing like the beauty stuff so I thought I would step up and do it so let me know if you guys have any ideas for more of these thank you guys so much for watching if you missed my previous video you can click here on the screen and watch it or link in my description to follow my social media so I'll either see you in that video or my next video I'll talk to you guys later Heart. bye